the securing of the United States' southern border is President Trump's red my lips moment. In 1988, then Vice President George W. Bush stood before the Republicans' National Convention in New Orleans and proclaimed, in his acceptance speech for the Republican nomination for president, read my lips, no new taxes. Then, after he became president, he broke that pledge, albeit in good faith and with bipartisan support for a tax increase. Thereafter, he lost his re-election due in large part to the breaking of his fundamental promise. Securing our southern border was a fundamental promise made by candidate Trump in his convention acceptance speech as well as during his campaign for the presidency. The president's current slogan is promises made, promises kept. He cannot stumble, falter or fail in making good on that fundamental promise about the border. The president's current battle to make good on his promise leaves him no option but to make good on it. He is in far worse shape if he caves than if he stands his ground on the government shutdown and holds out for a bargain that fundamentally makes good on that promise. We are stuck in a world of semantics with regard to border security. Trump calls for the building of a wall, and Democrats call for border security. The reality is that Democrats were for a wall before they were against it. In 2006, then Senator Barack Obama and Senator Charles Schumer took to the floor of the Senate to passionately orate in favor of the Secure Border Act of 2006, which called for more than 700 miles of border fencing. The act passed with wide bipartisan support. 